seconds. You guys thoughts down? Two more solid minutes, and you guys should be able to quickly fill out the vocabulary for the week. Focusing on the suffix, suffix is for the week. Is try to deduce meaning from the sentences given. Start us off. Uh, for the sake of time, I want to start our lesson today. I'm going to take five, uh, three. Three students to share. Everybody in class wanted to share for the past three periods. You guys, guys like these two now. Can you start us off? I said the point of having a physical differentiator is our own. meaning in my middle name, it comes from the Bible, that's what my mom told me. And then, my nickname is Beanie. That's what my sister said. Beanie? Beanie? Yeah. Daddy, so... Um, you can go ahead. Um, Jessica. 
Denotes a person's personal beliefs or, or a person, yeah, personal beliefs. Also, it denotes a person's profession. Oh, oh, or so, yes. I agree with Shana. An optimist is someone who only sees the good out of a bad or out of a bad situation. Excellent, guys. That's how you introduce me from the picture. And uh, I'm gonna look at Brian's here. Monday, optimist. Tuesday, linguist. Wednesday, pacifist. Thursday, apologist. Friday, opportunist. I would like to see all three boards on your next cards. Sitting here on the corner of your desk tomorrow. Complete the vocab cards. On the vocab card, what am I looking for? Things like oh, the definition, the um, a sentence, and then what it is, like what it is, like a noun, or a page, and then um, yeah, that's it. The definition is quite a piece. Excellent. Example. Sentence example. That's what I'm looking for. Remember what I said. You guys don't get half credit either. Did the full thing, or you did nothing. That's all I got. I have a question. So, what is your deal with that rules for the game? Um. Job. Ooh, reading in the books. Tomorrow's 
Two stage preview. Gallery walk. So, tomorrow's lesson is solely depending on how productive you guys are today. We're moving at a great pace right now. We're going to start group reading in two minutes. You guys finish reading today. You guys start your Save Me Matter chart. Come in tomorrow prepared. We can get started with our gallery walk. And then we will begin chapter 17. <laughs> Question, Edward. What if we finish our Save Me Matter chart today? Repeat it. What if we finish our Save Me Matter chart today? What do you mean? You said we're going to get Save Me Matter charts. You guys finish reading, and that should take. Oh no, he thinks that you um you're saying that if we don't finish, it's gonna be for homework. So you say what if we finish work? it here? Negative. This is class work today. Your homework and your vocabulary work. So I expect you guys to finish reading. I expect you guys to finish the same matter chart and finish <coughs> your remaining class. Roger. At the pace we are going. Okay. Jason, you're. Here, can you please? All right. Um, one second. Let's shut out the groups. It's not the same group as well. Negative again. Oh, Carlos! <laughs> Move on, actually. Listen. Group says. Carlos, Jessica, Joker Bet. Carlos, Jessica, Joker Bet. Kingsley, Edwards, Stephanie. Tyler, Irene, Brian. Isaiah, Kayla, Mackay. Shayna, Summer, Easy. Angel, Alexis, and Jim. Yeah. Is it the same group? Yeah, exactly. You want to switch it around. Negative. Nick. Roger. Wait. Don't move yet. Let's look at what I'm asking for you guys to do it once more. Can I read it? I did not see. No, I'll read it. Thank you, though, I did. I did not see this. Two I really wanted to see last week. I was a little disappointed. Each student takes turns reading a paragraph. Excellent, to the page finish. At the end of each page, <coughs> quietly discuss with one another the main idea if there is one, any word you do not recognize, what you deem important, underline and annotate. I don't want to see you guys just flying by page by page by page. After every page, I want to see all three of you guys stop, deduce meaning from the text, see what you guys annotated, see what your partner annotated, and that maybe that person can help you out. Another thing. You guys need to be listening heads up while you guys are reading. I'm tired of some people just wandering off while the partner is doing all the reading. That's not fair to your partner. So we'll just take points with it. 